Ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Welcome back to another episode of The Sims, busting out for Game Boy Advance. Today, we are working a little more on quests we need to do to complete this level, task, mission, whatever you want to call it. And we are going into the park to... Aha, there's a new person over here. Da 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 da, Nicky Nack. Hi, my name is Dale. Pleased to meet you, Dale. I'm Nicky Nack, owner and manager of Nicky Nack's Bric-a-brac trinket shop. If you ever need anything you don't really need, come see me. Do you have any overdue library books? Well, this is embarrassing, sugar. I meant to return it. I really did. But anyway, be a dear and bring it to Hester for me, would you? Aha, uh -huh. so that's Nicky. Um, okay, can't. Don't want to talk to that swell. Trying to get on my scooter. There we go. So I am looking for someone else. Oh, there's Dusty Hog. I don't think he can help me out. Uh, maybe I should just use the... No, go away. Wait, I still got on my scooter? That was a bit weird. Maybe I should just use the telephone communication device in order to find them. Although it is 6am. I guess we could go and do Moa Madness. We did level up last time, so we could get quite a chunk of money from that. Uh, I thought this certain person would be in the park, but I guess I can just ring him up. I want to look for Eddie Renolin. Okay, he's not on the first page. I thought he was. Um, is he not there anymore? I could have sworn that... Oh no, it's Mad Woody Hurts here, I think I was looking for. Getting a good workout at the gym! Of course, why not? Okay, so he's going to be at the gym for a while, so... the Oh, oh wait, if he's at the gym, how am I going to speak to him? The other person I want to speak to is... Um, not Melodious... What's her name? It has to pray him, because I want to return these two books. Uh, Virtue Cam, cool, we are right there, so let's go find her, return a couple of these books. I guess we could always go see old Phil McLean as well. Okay, go in here. Hi Hester, how's it going? Uh, I've got something for you. Uh, I got two of those, cool. So that's two of the books. Um, I guess we could always try and get a book off. Ooh, I know who else. No, I don't want to do that. Um, I believe Daddy Big Bucks has a book. Uh, Paradise Island, okay, so we can't quite get there. Um, call a friend. Who else has one? I don't think Bucky Brock has one. Detective Dan doesn't. Um, yeah, I think mm, Claire Clutterbell is the one we got one from before. Okay, let's just go to the gym and hope we can talk to um, Mad Willy Hurts you. And hopefully he doesn't hurt me. <laughs> ah, okay, yes. Um, let's go in here and... Can we talk to him? No, he's busy boxing. Dang it. Like, we have to wait until he's not boxing in order to actually talk to him, which kind of stinks. Because if we go over there now, like I said last time, he'll just put us on the floor. And we don't want to do that. <laughs> uh, let us go to the docks then and see if we can talk to old Phil McLean. Because uh, we got the fishing rod. We could also go to Nicky Neck's bric a brac Actually, what time is it? Is this open yet? Eh, why not go in here? See what they've got. Nothing too interesting. Do want that computer, though. Because why not? Um, we never did uh, put our hi-fi system and bed. Oh, wait, no. This is an old bed. I can get rid of this bed. I have no use for this bed anymore. Oh, hello, person. Uh, hi, my name is Dale. Hi, I'm Dwayne Doldrum. Uh, someday, I'm going to be the most famous sim in the world, just as soon as I figure out how and why. Uh, okay, so that's another person we got to talk to, I guess. Um, so if you didn't know, uh, this game has sort of like a, a popularity thing as well. Uh, you may have seen it before if I've uh, pulled up my relationships tab. There's old Salty. I wonder if he's got a book, actually. Old Salt, come here. No, he doesn't. Never mind. <laughs> um, is he going to be near the fish and chip shop? Yes, I wonder. We'll take a look. Ah, old Phil McLean, there he is. Okay, oh, and he wants to talk to us too. Are the fish biting? All the dang fish must be dead in this polluted ocean. I don't know why I bother sitting here. I haven't caught so much as a cold these past few weeks. Mind if I join you? If you're gonna stand around here and bother with me with insane chatty, you might as well get yourself a fishing pole. No point wasting my time if you're wasting yours too. Uh, I've never fished before in my life. Oh boy, you better pick up a copy of my cousin's book as well, Fishing for Fun uh, or Profit. He's a little hard up for cash these days. Oops. Uh, thanks for the advice. Bah, I should have charged you for it. Uh, I will give him the fishing rod though. And he will like me again. 
Um, is it true the mayor wants to build an aquarium? Does he have an uh, awesome fishing movie? Oh, he doesn't like fishing movies, okay. Nothing like a salty sea breeze and sunshine. Okay. Your hair is the same color as the fish and... No, good news, the salmon... Yeah, population slowly returning, yeah. You probably don't even know, I don't want to tell them that. Did you hear the one about the seventh? Oh, he likes jokes, okay. Uh, rumor has it that you're the best cast within 5,000... Everyone loves a compliment. Um... I once caught a fish bigger than that one of them. I can almost understand dolphins, he doesn't like that. Um, wouldn't dynamite be faster? Oh, he doesn't like that. Do you hear the one about the 17 foot trout? Yeah, that's good. Do you hear the one about the babbling sunburned young man? Yes, okay, this is good. Uh, if I catch your cheek with this hook, let me know. Okay, I'm gonna leave it there for now. Um, let's get back on the bike, or the scooter, and head to Nicky Nack's bric a brac. Pick up a can. Remember, you definitely want to pick up all these little items, because you never know when you're going to need them. Hi! Do you have a book, maybe? Nope. Melodious does not. Melodious. Get it? Because it's like music. Um, we'll check out the department store, see if there's anything good for sale. Kind of hoping Daddy Big Back Bucks was going to be here. Ooh, a double bed. Dang, kind of makes me wish I didn't get that bed last time. Oh well, doesn't matter. We shall still head towards the bric a brac shop. Yeah, Daddy Big Bucks tends to spend a lot of his time on the Paradise Island, which is a shame, because he should be doing other stuff, like, uh, I don't know, giving me unused books that need to be returned to the dang library. Uh, you never know who else we're going to come across, because, oh, oh, I just had another idea, never mind, uh, because there is someone in these parts which may have a book. Who are you? Oh, you're the, you're the salesperson. Flyers, oh yes. Fishing for Final Profit. And I need to give out these flies to people, don't I? Yeah. Okay, goal completed. I think that was the fishing thing. I can give the fishing book back to uh, Salty anyway. But let's have a look along the beach. Oh, oh, nuclear rod. Yeah. Okay, because along the beach we may find someone else that could also... Um, oh, Phil McLean's back here. Didn't realise he came here, actually. There we go. And old Salty as well. So this is someone else. Hi, my name's Dale. This is Misty Waters. I'm Sim Valley's best and only lifeguard, which means I get a lot of sun, but not a lot of swimming practice. I'm looking for an overdue library books. Do you have any checked out? Sure do. There we go. Okay, can I have one of them? Bah, bah, bah. Sure thing. Take this one. I never opened it. Pockets are full. Dang it. Let's give a flyer to old Salty. Uh, I've got something for you. Flyer. Thanks. You're welcome. I'll actually give one to Phil McLean as well as the fishing book. Can I actually just... Yeah, can I give him the fishing book, or can I give him... Or do I give him something else? No thanks. Oh. What do I do with the fishing book? I'll give him the flyer. He kind of likes that. Cool. At least that gives us room... Uh, to talk to Misty Waters. And... Okay, there we go. We've got one of them, so... Uh, we can also... Give her a flyer as well. So that was another goal complete. Which one was that, actually? Um, we just got to impress old Phil McLean to 40 and we've done that one. That's awesome. Um, return three books to Hester and we've done that one. I wonder if we can get both of these done today. That would be great. Uh, I wonder if I can actually... Wait, where's... Phil McLean, come back. Um, some of my relatives were pirates. No, he doesn't like that. Uh, I'm pushing for a spit. No, no, he really doesn't like that. <laughs> Rising Tide? No, he doesn't like that. Hope you're wearing clothes. I wish you were my grandfather. Oh, he doesn't like that either, really. Um, let's leave him alone. Go back to him. Do fish have feelings? No. Oh, wow. He really doesn't like me. Good news. Salmon population was turning. Yeah, there we go. Puffer fish is so amazing. Oh, he likes that. Sorry, I think I scared away catch. He doesn't like um, apologies. I don't think this dock is safe. Is it true? The mayor wants to build an aquarium. I almost understand dolphins. No. Uh, is there anything this landlubber can do for you? Uh, deliver these lures to Claire Clutterbell, okay. Uh, do you hear the one about the, the joke? Yeah, can't talk, have to pee. Okay, cool. Well, <laughs> I got his relationship down and then back up again, so that's something, I guess. Now let's head this way. Uh, hey, we got all the books we need, which is fantastic. Um, because I'm gonna go pee. And then talk to Hester Prim. Oh, I want to go... No, I don't want to go that way. I want to go this way. Uh, we may as well just put our needs up. 
at the clock tower. Okay, here we go. Uh, so our bathroom was over here. Just take a quick pee. It's great because it will also put up our uh, homely requirements as well. Take a quick shower, not that we really need one, but we'll take one anyway. Sit down on the couch for a brief second, although my comfort goes up while I'm on the scooter, doesn't it? Uh, let's just have a quick snack or two. Actually, I don't have a couch anymore, do I? I sold it. I never got a replacement. Wah, wah, wah. Okay, that's fine. Oh, before we go, actually, I guess what we could do is see where Hester Prim is. Call... Not services, call a friend, because uh, we don't actually get charged for using this phone, because it is our phone. Uh, Hester Prim. Hester Prim. Hester Prim is around the clock tower. Okay, so she's right outside. That's fantastic. And the other person I need to talk to is Claire Clutterbell, I think. That's who Old Phil McLean wants me to deliver that thing to. And she is at Hayseed Farm. Cool, so that should be quick. Um, I'm actually going to go talk to Claire Clutterbell first. Uh, since she... Uh, oh, there's Vera Vex. Um, oh, she's probably not going to be in the actual farm, though. She'll probably be right outside. There she is. Uh, I've got something for you. It's the fishing lure for Claire Clutterbell. 160 simoleons. Nice. So, yeah, sometimes you luck out on who you have to deliver it to, and they, they give you extra money, but someone like Dusty Hog only gives about, like, 30 simoleons, 16 or something stupidly small like that. There she is. Uh, on the other side there. Hello from the other side. No, stop, Dale. Uh, I've got something for you. Can I actually give her that one? What do I do with that book? Can I just sell that book? <laughs> hey, thanks. All clear, ma'am. Bless you. Now we can continue to nudge the young minds of this town. The library is open from 9am to 5pm every day. Anytime you want to study a book, just come on by. So that is how you put up skills in this game. You literally just go there and uh, read books. I mean, it's the easy way of putting up skills uh, other than the cheat. Which wasn't really a cheat. Okay, so I need some comfort in my life. Let's see, how many, does it say how many um, flies I've actually distributed? I've done five, I think. Uh, that one's done. You know, we've done that one as well. <laughs> so it's literally, uh, we've got to befriend the cop. Uh, so that would be Dan the man. Um, what else can I do? I need comfort, but I also need those flyers. So I guess I'm going to go buy those flyers first. Quickest way would probably be south. Oh, down this way. And Dan Demand is usually... Actually, he can be found in a jail sometimes. Obviously, like, because he is the policeman, he can... He's, he's busy putting people away, you know. Putting down the trouble... Well, not putting down the troublemakers, but putting away the troublemakers. Why did I come this way? Oh yeah, the flyers. Oh wait, her shop's gonna be shut now, isn't it? Dang it. Okay, I'll have to get some more tomorrow. Um, actually, you know what? I think we're pretty much done for today. Uh, we didn't really sp uh, spend much time making money, which is a nice change, I guess. But we have been running around. Oh my goodness, can I just... There we go. Can I go in the restaurant and sit down? Yeah, let's just take a seat in the restaurant. <laughs> you know, there's not much point because I may as well just go back home and... Uh, Sleep it off because I need to wait until the morning anyway and put on my comfort and my sleep So I think that's what I'm gonna do that is gonna do it for today guys Thank you all very much for watching this episode of the Sims of busting out for Game Boy Advance and uh, Yeah, thanks very much Of course, I will see you all in the next one where we will probably get the last of these missions done It's gonna be a bit difficult getting all of these uh Like uh, relationship ones done because uh, you have to know what people like and I, I don't really know what people like so yeah, anyway, thank you all very much for watching. I, of course, will see you all next time. Goodbye.